Welcome back, Mayors. My name's Tokriva, and this is some more City Skylines playing Los Horus. I heard church bell chiming. And yeah, this I, I really love this asset. Someone made a complete aqua fun park. I already have the downtown swim club going on, but I built this one on the other side of the river as a park because it just looks pretty damn cool. Even has reflections in the windows. See? And it's just a basic reflection. Refraction, reflection of a high skyline city it's you can see this building here is the same right now as this building there it's it's just a standard reflection that you can see on all the windows of all the buildings basically it, it just gives you a sense of depth you know it not necessarily means it's very um immersive that way but still it gives you that sense slightly at least uh, yellow cornfields are a much better site than farms. Of course they are. Now the question remains. Um, should I or should I not get a second industrial area started? And should or should I not get a highway connected to downtown? I think the first one would actually be very, very useful. And that connection should end up underneath here. Basically, this area, yeah... I've just decided this area, once we actually unlock it, and a couple of thousand people, will connect to a highway that runs underneath the riverside and will come up over maybe here? No. It should come out maybe... Yeah, we do need to have a good place then for a crossing. I mean, it could be beneath here and nobody knows it's there, but... I do like to show it off slightly. I mean, this is not a bad looking um, on and off ramp system. Same as here, this one is even more compact. This one is just, yeah, get on or, and get off again. There's a jam over here, holy crap. But they start moving again. All on the same bloody lane, but okay. It's all the people that need to go straight ahead, and there's not enough roads to go straight ahead. Did I fix this one myself? Or did I not? Um, yeah, I did. So if I changed this road, we would have to fix the entire intersection again. Not something I'm looking forward to. I could just turn this into a larger um, split off um, cloverleaf connection, interchange, and then that goes underground here, and then still has like connections over here near the university. One near Riverside, definitely the one here near downtown. I think that would not be the worst idea, but it's going to take some engineering. Especially this bit. Okay, so that's gone. Now this needs to also go, and this needs to go. Um, okay, first things first, there will be, once more, a bridge that goes across the water. This needs to go up here quite a bit. Out of city limits, but it's possible. That's probably too high already.
doesn't look like a straight line, but that can be fixed quite simply by doing this instead. There, it looks reasonably straight. And then this is the start of the bridge across the river. So we need to do that again, like here. Yeah, that looks, ooh, that looks even better. Just a straight up line. Probably because, um, yeah. Because we made it in two parts, it just connected to the second part there. Roughly parallel, and I just need to turn these all around. Okay, so that's part one. Um, part two, should I already make it underground here? No. I feel like it should go underground back here. So... Is that... Okay, so... There we go, underground. The same thing on the other side. And voila, we have our road going down here. Just running that the other way around as well. Good, so this is where they will cross. And there we go. And let's um, bring it down. Roughly here. Okay, so now we have our interchange, or the intersection of the interchange. Now we just need to connect them together. And that's going to be the fun part. Uh -huh. So this one needs to go in the clover leaf formation. There we go, that's one. Yeah, I'm not gonna make it look pretty this time around. I mean, it's just gonna take too much time, to be honest. Okay, yeah, it needs to go up on this first bit or else it won't be able to make the corner. So like that, and then... Like that. Okay, so we have... Yeah, it looks weird, but it should be fine. And then... This needs to be made a little bit longer. There we go, that looks pretty well, actually, pretty decent. You go down roughly there, and continue that way. Nearly fits, but... Hmm. I don't like how that looks. That looks better. And the final one. 
go up one and connect like there. There we go, and this still leaves enough room for us to put this underneath here. Perfect, just perfect. It's not the best looking interchange, but it's freehand. It's not bad at all. I actually recognize the clover. Maybe the clover is not that good of a uh, thing anymore though. Um, it's a little bit bad, but it still works somehow. Okay, now let's go down. This is basically to make the city center a lot better connected to the outside. The highway right next to this river lake and everything. Yeah, it's gonna that in reality that might cause problems, but this is still a game, so fine, I'll do it the other way around. I do want some connection somewhere over here as well. Um, even though this road would be very, very useful for that. Um, it's just already a bit too crowded and it has the bus line next to it as well. So it's probably just going to be somewhere like right here. This, um, I think this block will be dezoned because of it. I'm really sorry, but we're gonna have to move. It does allow me to basically do this as well. Oh crap, oh crap, oh crap, oh crap. That was a little bit too much dezoning going on. There we go, and let's do this one as well. Some more high density stuff. This is where we'll have one of our uh, intersections, our on and off ramps coming out. Wow, that's just great. And yeah, the hardest part is the fact that this one will not yet be connected, sadly. Why did people move out here? Uh, commercial. Well, there is a highway going on here that's just hidden from plain sight. Yeah, that's why I need this title. Oh, I need 2,000 people. Um, of course, we lost a few with the redrawing of this little bit right there. Um, let's see, that's going that way, so... Yeah, there's not a lot of room left here to do this, sadly. Probably gonna make some interesting going things. I just need to turn this one around. Okay, that works, but now for the difficult one. Jesus. OK, 
Okay, um, how are am I going to do this one? I probably placed them too close together. Yeah. Okay. That's definitely the wrong bit of road I just destroyed. And I just gotta make sure that none of the bus lanes got... Nope, don't appear to be. Okay. Bus lanes seem to be in order. Then it's good. Let's go back down there. also a problem of course um okay wait what how weird is this it's like extremely weird because it's so far down right now damn it <sighs> that's probably a bit too much then This is like one of the most illogical roads ever. That should leave me enough room here in the middle. Actually, yeah, it does. Um... That's one. This is difficult. Um, you know what? I'm going to do a slightly different solution to these two. Okay, and now for a 
rendezvous that goes something like this. There's also that metro going on there. That's so annoying. Wow, this works. This actually works. Okay. Seriously, buses? What? Oh lord. This bus line, seriously, what the heck is it even doing? Because it's the fastest route or something weird? Um, you know what? Screw that. I need to get this line. Line three, bus line. There we go. That fixes that bit at least. Well, we have ourselves a bus uh, going on. Um, for the sake of making it slightly better, I'm going to connect these roads here. Actually, going to do that slightly different as well. There we go. That should be a lot better. So, now we have our highway connection in Riverside. Um, I wonder when they will start using that, but... <sighs> One and a half thousand more people and we connect it up here in downtown as well. Until then, I want to thank you all for watching. Make sure to like this video if you enjoyed it. And subscribe to the channel if you want to keep up to date in the future. I will see you guys later.